Hey everyone, I'm outside of 3rd Avenue Garden. Uh, today I'm going to be picking out a lunch, and this is just going to be a supplementary video to the nutrition ebook I created. So I'm going to walk in, get a lunch. I just came back from cross country practice, so I'm going to need some calories, and I'm going to show you guys what I get. So tune in. So here's what I got I got one loaf of this uh, whole rye bread. It's funny, a lot of the other brands, like the Pepperminch uh, Farm, and honestly, I would say like 90% of the loaves of bread that are sold in stores like that. Uh, most of them have sugar. This is the only one I could find that did not have sugar. Uh, it's more whole grains. If like, if you can see texture in the bread, that's how you know it's healthy. Uh, if it's ever white, if it's ever a sugar in it, and you can tell by looking at the ingredients, that's something you should try to avoid. If it's the only option, is what it is. It's not gonna kill you, but this is definitely the most healthy option. Um, this will last me for a few lunches because you know it's a few slices in there. The other thing I got is. Black Forest uncured ham. This is probably two lunches that'll last me. Uh, this is just really good in my opinion. You can get turkey, you can get whatever you want. This Applegate Nationals, it's a good brand. <clears throat> it's not too expensive either. It's $8.99, it's a little bit, but it's two lunches, so divide that by two. Um, and then, provolone cheese, dairy. Uh, it's really good for you. My dad, he grew up eating a lot of dairy. He told me that when he got his wisdom tooth removed, uh, they said his teeth were some of the strongest he's ever seen, so it goes to show all that calcium and dairy. It's good for your teeth. Um, some berries. Oh, I mean, that's just something to keep in the fridge. It's a good little treat after cross country. Uh, and also a simple ingredient, you know, natural sugar, nothing added. And then a tomato. That'll last me a few lunches as well. Uh, and I have some lettuce in my house. That's why I didn't get it in the store. But if I did not have lettuce in my house, I would get it. So. I got. Uh, I spent a subtotal of twenty nine fifty eight, but the bread will last me four lunches. The tomato will last me four lunches. The cheese will last me three or four lunches, and the turkey will last me like two. So good purchase. Um, this is what I got. This is obviously it's a pretty nice. Uh, it's called Third Avenue Garden. It's on like ninety uh, ninety first and third. So obviously there's some bodegas that are a little bit more limited, but all things considered, uh, it's a good option. And these are just packaged easy goods. You know, blueberries, tomatoes, turkey, just the simples. No added sugar, no preservatives, no, it's just simple good stuff. So thank you for tuning in. If you want to learn any more, then please visit the nutrition ebook and you can learn a little bit. Uh, you can read about the thought process of what I go through when I'm making purchases and you can also learn a little bit more about the nutrition of each key category like carbohydrates, proteins, fats, and learn how to make choices in bodegas like these ones. So thank you for tuning in.